I said at the time, I said, there's one thing on the horizon, which is these GLP-1 agonists, which originally started as semaglutide, uh, and uh, which was a GLP-1 agonist. And I said, these are going to be life-changing uh, for, for a lot of people, and they're going to make a huge impact on the obesity epidemic. And as it turns out, over the last five years, some estimates say as many as 15% of the population, that's 40 million people. Yeah, that the U.S. have already, and international, these medications have been used by uh, certainly way, way more, uh, have already utilized these medications. Mostly it works on the brain, on the reward center of the brain. I think it may be a, a dopamine type uh, process, which fortunately doesn't seem to be the same reward center for uh, libido. So it doesn't suppress that, but it can suppress. We have seen a significant reduction or uh, in in uh, in some uh, addictive behaviors, alcohol, that's great. Maybe even gambling, uh, yeah. cigarette smoking. Some people just don't find the same degree of pleasure from those things when they're on these medications, which is certainly a good side effect. That's great. Yeah. 